One of the most important components of this house renovation is changing the colour of the house. Transforming it is going to be achieved with the power of paint. It's so cost effective and very dramatic, but when it comes to picking white, what is the right white? I get asked this a lot. Now, I've honed down the massive range of whites that are available and broken it down into a perspective five. I'm also gonna paint this in various sections around the house, so that's important because light from north to south, east to west, plays very differently on color. And a really important tip is write them down so that you know Just what colors it, are in order. Time. One of the best investments you can make is to buy the sample pots. They're not expensive. They're only a few dollars each, but this is so valuable because it's gonna be much more expensive if you paint the whole house in the wrong color. So this is a really important step. Show me your groove. Yeah. I'm ready. Your harlot. So I've got my five swatches on the wall. They're already starting to dry. I can see the slight tonal difference, even though they might look quite similar. The key here is that they're in locations facing different directions around the house. So I've got it to catch the different light. I now need to let them dry and then to look at them at different times of the day. And that's going to allow me to see how the light plays on the color so that I can pick the perfect white and make this house an amazing Palm Springs inspired white masterpiece. So I've got my five Taubman swatches and I've painted them in three different locations of, around the house. I've watched the light change throughout the day from early morning till now in the afternoon. It's a really important process to see how the color looks at different locations in the house as well as throughout the day when the light is changing. The top one, Akimbo, which is a color I love and use a lot. I think it's just too bright for this location inside. So the second one down and the bottom, they're just quite gray based. So I feel like they're a little bit too gray for this house. I do want that clean white Palm Springs look. I come back to these two. I've got the Dover white there. It's a beautiful white. Um, it's a little bit cooler. And since I'm teaming it up with some other colors here in the metals for the rest of the house, I think I keep coming back to this one down here. It's called Ghosting. It's a really great color. It's slightly gray based. Uh, it works so well here and it's also slightly warmer, which is gonna work really well with the landscaping. So that's the color. Definitely worth the process to make sure that the whole house is painted in the perfect white for this project.